morning, everyone, and happy Thursday. Whew, sorry, I didn't do no video yesterday. I was busy. I was busy doing something else. I said I was going to tell myself I would make a video yesterday on JJ, but I'm going to make it today, and I, um, I'm up, and I'm I got a low fumes of sleep because my arthritis in my back is killing me. And I didn't get no sleep until, oh, I think about 4, 4 or 5 o'clock this morning because I was tossing and turning all night. So I decided to, uh, because when I take this stuff down, and then my niece was on my mind because today is her birthday. Happy birthday, Toya, in heaven. And so I decided to take a bath. But while I was out shopping, I think on Tuesday, I was at Roses, you guys. <laughs> and, I, and I was getting me some old body uh, shower gels and stuff and some old products for me and uh, stuff. So for my bathroom to take a shower and everything. And I ran across this body oil, you guys. And I, and I saw it and I thought about JJ. <laughs> it's... It's a melatonia. It's a melatonin body oil. <laughs> and I got it. It smells good, too. It smells real good on your body. So at 3 something this morning, I, cooked, I, I was in so much pain. So I took me a hot bath. And I put, put that in my water. And I put it in. And then I, when I got out and dried off, I put some more on me because you know I got eczema and I had to put a lot of oil out so my skin can absorb it up so I won't be itchy and everything. And then I say about and I took my arthritis pills and stuff, they weren't helping, so that's why I took that that uh bath, that hot bath, and put that in there. And I fell asleep about about I say about four or four or five o'clock and stuff. And I got up back at eight because my uh, cause Chase pounced on my dog on chest this morning. I was sleeping so good, girl. I see why you bought this. I see why you be buying all the dog on stuff. Cause I ain't never took no really no melatonin. I took the it ain't really just absorbed into my body. I was just sleeping so peaceful and rest on cause this and my pills finally had kicked in. All of that stuff had kicked in. But I was sleeping so peaceful and restless. Oh, I'm just sleep. I was just like, oh. And then Chase had to pounce on my dog on chest, and I popped my eyes open, looking right in his dog on big old eyes. He was ready to go outside because he usually I'm usually up about six or seven o'clock, and I can take him outside so he can run around the backyard and use it. Him and Stella. But I overslept this morning. He like, uh, uh, mama, mm -mm, you going to get up, baby. Because it's past, it's past time for me to go outside. So, about 8 something, he, it was going on, it was almost 9 o'clock. <laughs> and I was just sleeping so good. I ain't had no sleep all night. I'm still tired. You see, the, my, drink me some cocoa or whatever. And, uh, because my bags, I, I ain't got, I don't have no bags, nothing but, but uh, my eyes are tired. And stuff because I don't know if it's gonna rain or what, but yeah, I had to sit back and look and observe that dog on video again with with uh hips because if he's not and if he's not a pedophile, or whatever she making the she making the man look like he's a pedophile on the videos. That's all we saying, uh JJ, that you put these videos out and stuff. Excuse me, I'm, I'm just tired. You putting these videos out, baby, and you showing the world every doggone thing. On my camera, only thing you get to see is my. Sometimes you can see my bedroom. That's that's mainly it, the bedroom, and that wall right there. And every now and then, I I show my house and stuff. I don't show everything that I want that I want everybody to see. I just show them what I want them to see in my house. It ain't nothing fishy going on in my house like it is with yours. But when I looked at that video and then the Eric's 
Then I looked at the Eric's video when he was she was giving him the bath bomb. Maya came out. He gave her the bath bomb. That's where you should have left it off it right there, baby. Hips. That's where you should have left it off it. When you gave her that bath bomb, you should have brought your big big hip ass back and sat back on that dog on couch. Or got a legend like you did. But you went on back there with her in that room. And you stayed back there for a few minutes. Then you came back out. And then you got a legend. And you sat on that couch for a few minutes. And then you hopped your big ass right back up. And went right back into that room. On a bathroom or what? I don't know if it was a bedroom, bathroom or what. I don't know. I don't forget how her house is and everything. I don't forget what room is what now. And stuff. But you went back into that room. That, that... That dude, that dude alert with every fucking body, baby. That that alert, that alarm went off on every single female and males I see now. They just started talking about it. But like I said, when you gave her that bath bomb, you should have left it that, and you had to go back there. You could have just let her went on back there, and that's it. And Jazz need to get off that damn camera, like I done said once before. Stay your black ass off that camera, because you always into that camera, begging and talking, and begging and begging and begging your subs. Somebody, you you saving your money up. Yeah, you done watched Chris's videos again, baby. And I see you got a little pound of our sisterhood stuff, girl, please. You didn't see no pound of you. I know it hurted you. I know it hurted you that all the reactors are loving Chrissy. Because she's in change. She's a different person, girl. You still the big and manipulated person that treats your kids wrong. Bring out these same old ass, boring ass videos so we can react on them. If you put it out there, we're going to really look at it. We're going to observe it. We're going to sit back and we're going to look and we're going to think about what we're going to talk about on that video, about that video. That's what we do. We just like TM, uh, TM, TMZ. We observe every doggone thing. Some of them observe more than I do. I get tired and say, well, I just turn it off because it be irking my nerves. But I go back and I watch the other reactors and I look at their opinions. Then I go back to the videos and I observe some more about my opinions on it. Then I go make a video. But like Chris has said, stop putting out there. You know, people like drama. But that's just not, that's not old drama. That's, that's some sickly, nasty ass shit. For him to do and for you to do. You stay in that camera. You live in that camera. You you, you and live, like Gerard said that time. Live be up all doggone night going through and following the reactors and looking at what they saying. So y'all can go make a video about what they didn't say it. That's how y'all get y'all content. Of watching us and then you go make a video. But with Jazz, she lets folks know she making the uh that she done watched us and everything because she gonna make a video too. <clears throat> and we done talked about the exact same thing. And you go and try to prove it. What you ain't trying to prove, what you need to stop doing is letting that man that's not them kids' father. He ain't even a stepdad. Because a stepdad helps out and pitch in. But they just a bomb that you mooching off of. And then you line, I, I watched the Eric's about the CPS and everything. You stay blogging about every doggone thing. But that CPS wasn't real. Because you were just too fucking hype. And you always, huh, 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 come on, do this. Huh, do, you're not going to do nothing. You and Liv is not going to fight no damn about it. Y'all talk a lot of smack because y'all on these cameras. But if that person ever, and I mean ever, come to you and say, are you ready? Y'all ain't going to know what the fuck to do. Y'all going to bow down. Y'all going to be scared and shit. But then you're going to get back on that camper. <laughs> talking that shit. But that shit going to get you in trouble one day. Talking that damn smack. Somebody going to knock the shit off. They're going to knock your ass off your feet. You're going to come around. The, you're going to come across the wrong damn person. Talking that smack. And they're going to come to you. And they're going to knock your ass out. And they're going to show you who they really are. 
because they're going to beat the shit out of your ass. So I advise you to stop talking all that damn smart ass shit on the damn camera because somebody going to test you. They're going to test you and come to you and they're going to find you and they're going to beat the crap out of your ass. So stop talking all that damn smack on your damn channel. This supposed to be a doggone family channel. These are not family channels no more. The only thing they talking about is you talking about Chris doing this, Chris doing that, and all that crap. We are sick of that doggone shit. We are tired of it. We are tired. And then I did not know you put that doggone diffuser in that baby's bed, look girl. You don't put that thing that close to that baby. If you didn't want that baby, you shouldn't have cocked your damn legs open. You knew he was, he was gonna be a handful. All your all everybody kids are a handful. My granddaddle is a handful. I say that all the deck on that. She's a handful. Because she's always want this and wanna do this and all like that. And I be and I be wanna do dress and stuff, but I put my time aside a day aside when she's here and we go do girly things. We do girly things. But I'm still waiting on Ava, Aiden, and uh, Kayla's two days you're going to be spending with them on your blogs. What happened to them, baby? I'm still waiting. I want to see them so I can react on them. But, like I said, you just all talk and do this just for the videos, and everybody know it. Some of your subs are finally opening their eyes up, and I am so happy. I am so happy they finally opened their eyes up and seeing the real you. They are seeing the real. They finally seeing what we are talking about. And then you're talking about other kids. Go potty train and finish helping that doctor, helping that lady teach Ava and Aiden how to talk, how to write. Because kindergarten is coming, baby. Pre-K is coming. Teach them more things. That's what you need to do while you're up there doing all that damn TikToking. And then you had that baby, that little hula hoop thing, exercise hula hoop that you had on. I don't want your TikTok or somebody sent it to me. And I'm like, what the hell? You got that baby in your hand and you hula hooping and that thing going around. You don't know if that thing was going to pop that baby or what. I know it's soft, but that's still a baby and it can still hurt that baby. It might not hurt you, but it can hurt that baby. And stop doing childish, silly little, little girl things. But I didn't want to talk too much on here because I'm tired. And I haven't watched no YouTube today at all. It's... Oh, excuse me, you guys. <sighs> but you just need to stop. Like Chris said, stop putting all this random ass shit out here to get for your views to go high. You do it. For your views to get be high as hell. You click back to get folks to watch your videos. And then you do all this stupid ass shit. So your views can be high as hell. So you can get paid. Your views can be high as hell. When you're doing beautiful not, uh, beautiful things with your kids. You got all those kids there. And we are waiting on you to do something with them. But if it's just for the videos. At least you're doing something with them but you need to do something with them when the video the camera is off but your camera is on all the dog on time and them kids are not being watched and being protective because like i said when he gave that baby that bath bomb he could have went and sat his fat ass back down on that couch or did whatever he wanted to do but he didn't he followed her back there and stay back there for a few minutes. I should have timed it. I should have timed him how long he was back there. Then he go back with legend in his hands. I nobody nobody knows why he went back there again. We don't know. And then he stayed for a few more minutes and stuff. Like I say, we don't know. But he shouldn't have been back there. You don't hold no conversation with no six-year-old. You talk to them and see how they day are. And you, everybody play games with them and stuff with the little kids. Because Ladera play games with Kayla. I play games with Kayla. 
but it's a point when the mama steps in and do the rest of it because when my boys were little and Danny was there Danny acted he played games and stuff with them we played games with them and everything but he never did go in the bathroom with my boys he never did take nothing to my boys he stayed his butt out I didn't go in there I said if I if I if they needed anything I was still Ladarius in there because they are boys because I'm not gonna walk in on my children because that, that, that's disgusting. And, yep. So, that's all I want to talk about today. Because I'm exhausted. And I just want to show y'all melatonin in the body oils for adults. And stuff. Jazz, don't you put this, don't you see this. Do not see that and go put it on those kids. Don't see that and go put it on those children, please. If I see this in one of your videos, I'm going to fall out laughing. I'm going to fall out laughing, little girl. But that's all for today, you guys. And I will talk to you later. I hope you have enjoyed this video. And don't forget to share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And I will see y'all on the next video. Bye.